In Johannesburg, the game of squash is trying to break the cycle of poverty. It's an unusual sport for townships, but Egoli squash is providing a way out and creating a distraction from poverty and crime. Egoli squash is a central Houghton squash development program that uh, uses squash as a vehicle of uh, tackling issues affecting the youth that are vulnerable. Looking at uh, areas that are living in poverty, um, crime, uh, drugs, teenage pregnancy, all those things that are affecting communities these days. Ray Lamini came to Egoli Squash as a troubled youth. Today he's a coach and mentor to children and a 2018 Laureus Youth Leader. Considering that I come from you know, a pretty uh, difficult background in Hillbro, um, you know, Egoli Squash has you know, they prov they helped me uh, develop my, my sporting career from around the age of 13 and now I'm currently playing in the provincial first league. They've also helped me on the academic side considering that they took me through high school and university. So all those doors have been opened up for me through a goalie squash. The squash program provides a safe space for children to thrive. We have got a life skills program that we run to empower kids, to empower them with skills so that they can be better people tomorrow. Egoli Squash changed my life um, in all things because it disciplined me in everything and um, I got a scholarship out of Egoli Squash which is a good thing and it helps my family with uh, school fees and stuff. I really enjoy it and Squash is my life. The program has developed players that have represented South Africa at the All Africa Championships while also producing players ranked in the country's top 10. We have achieved a lot. We've seen our kids rising through the ranks uh, to, to top 10 in the country and also the juniors as well doing well. We've got number ones and two in all age groups, both boys and girls. With each swing, the lives of many youngsters here is changing and Egoli Squash is ensuring this isn't just a temporary escape, but a way forward to a happy and successful life. Julie Shara, CGTN, Johannesburg, South Africa.